We already know Google offers a ton of apps and services for Android. I'm Taylor Martin, this is Pocket Now, and these are some Google made applications that you may not know about. When you think of all the applications Google has made for Android, your mind probably races with all the apps that regularly make headlines when they're updated. Gmail, Hangouts, YouTube, Calendar, Wallet, and most importantly, Google Search, the app that now envelops Google Now. But Google has been hard at work developing, and sometimes acquiring, applications and services that make the Google experience more complete, especially for Android. And there are quite a few applications in Google Play that you may not know exist. All the important applications listed above come pre-installed on most Android devices, but there are a few applications Google developed that some of us at Pocket Now install immediately upon setting up a new device, such as Google Keep, Translate, or sometimes even Goggles. But these apps just scratch the surface. If you open Google Play, navigate to a Google-made app like Gmail, scroll down, and click More by Google Incorporated, you will see every Google application that is compatible with your device. Some of you may already know about Currents, especially if you are a user of Google Reader and scrambled to find an alternative. Currents is sort of like Google's own version of Flipboard, a magazine-style newsfeed for offline reading. If you follow a ton of sites, there are a few better ways to slice through a backlog of reading than Currents. If you're into fitness and tracking applications, MyTracks is a nice alternative to RunKeeper. It records your jogs, runs, and bike rides by way of GPS, tracking your path, speed, distance, and elevation. For those online shoppers out there, Google Shopper aggregates prices and products from many online stores to help you compare prices and get the best deals. And speaking of deals, Google Offer shows you all the local deals being offered by the businesses around you. Get a discount on your next car repair, or get a free trial at the local gym. Both of these are great at helping you become a more frugal shopper. Gesture Search is a shortcut application which allows you to search contacts, browser bookmarks, applications, and music. It can be activated from within any application with what is called the double flip motion. And to search, you simply draw the first letter of what you're looking for with your finger. This can be very useful if you have a ton of content on your phone, but the double flip motion does take some getting used to. If you're looking for some harmless, casual fun, try Androidify. Choose between hairstyles, colors, outfits, accessories, and shape and size to create the Androidified you. We've spent more hours goofing off in this app than we care to admit. Lastly, if you are <coughs> bored at home on a Friday night, you might want to check out Schemer. When you log in for the first time, you get to choose all the different categories that interest you. Then, you get to scheming. Essentially, this is a way to crowdsource your activities. To see what your online friends are doing or have done, and, likewise, share what you've done to help others come up with fun things to do, locally, at home, or otherwise. When you're bored and out of ideas, open Schemer, and some of the things you've shown interest in doing will be suggested. I have no plans this evening, so I may check out Valhalla and Charlotte. That's going to do it. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to click the thumbs up button and subscribe, and give us a follow on Google+, Twitter, or Facebook at Pocket Now. I'm Taylor Martin, and I'll see you next time.